go to sea, we are at war every day. Stand by. All right, Mark, Torpedo 5. Bolt. Five bolt fired, turn battery, fire bolt. Surely there must be something you can do. I'm doing everything I can. Just stop calling me Shirley. <laughs> Nobody really complains about the creature comforts. This is a Virginia class submarine, we accept it. You know when you come here, this is what you're gonna have. It's not an expectation that you thought was gonna be different. Oh, it's a taco night. It's taco night. I'm not sure what I'm talking about. Alright, let me get the Thank you. I don't why didn't you go to sleep? It's about our time, huh? Attention to dolphin ceremony. To all shall see these presents, greetings. Greetings. Submarine qualification certificate to culinary specialist seaman submarines, Devin M. Williams. Having successfully completed the rigorous professional requirements for qualification in submarines, having gained a thorough knowledge of submarine construction and operation, having demonstrated your reliability under stress, and having my full confidence and trust, I hereby certify that you are qualified in submarines. Culinary Specialist Williams, qualified in submarines. The Bible is clear about not killing, and I believe in that wholeheartedly. I believe that when you are a Christian and you are walking this walk, I do believe you have to live by that Bible 100%. That's probably the hardest question that I've even posed in my own mind, is that question right there. I'm in the Navy, I'm on a, a war vessel. God's people, especially in the Old Testament, were not only people that uh, he was trying to bring Jesus Christ through, but they also were warriors. Escaping from the submarine is like the last resort. When we go down, we actually want to have someone come get us. That's the preferred way. Depths of 600 feet is the maximum escape depth. Anything deeper than that, the chance of survival is, you know, up in the air. You step in, you plug into your, these are called soul charging valves. You actually plug in them. And you hold on the hand, the handle right there. When you do that, your suit's going to become positively buoyant. There's going to be so much air in there, you're going to be floating. As soon as we pull out of port and we submerge the ship, uh, everybody else is a target. And we practice being at war every single day. 